right, we're doing a haul video. We hit I don't know, probably 10 or 12 thrift stores today. And uh, here's what we got. All right, we hit an Ohio thrift. And we ended up spending under $20. We got this uh, Franklin Spelling Ace. We paid $9 for it. We saw some going for as high as $50 and some were going for $25 sealed. Uh, we're going to try to go, we're going to try to go about $40. This is a Reebok Ohio State basketball warm up. It's made in Korea. It's probably from the 80s. Everything at that store was 50% off any of the clothes. So we got that one for $250. Got an Ohio State Buckeyes. Nike sweatshirt. It's pretty cool. It's got the big O. It's vintage. It was uh, $6, so we got it for $3. We're probably going to sell that for, for $30 or $40. Darth Vader naughty shirt, new with tags. We paid a dollar for it, it's a 3X. We sell novelty shirts pretty well at the store. I figure it's gonna be Christmas time pretty soon, so we picked it up. We got one, uh, your gift is in the litter box. It's brand new with tags, 2X, and it was $2. Christmas vacation, hallelujah. It was 50 cents. Getting ready for a little Christmas rack at the store. These will sell around Christmas time. And that's all we got at Ohio Thrift. All right, guys, our next stop was the St. Vincent de Paul. And we paid 25 cents for a Tammy Faye Baker. I just thought it was funny. That's all we found. I paid 25 cents for it. They were going for about $10 on eBay. But that's all we got there. Our next stop was Salvation Army. They were having a half price day. We picked up these K-Swiss shoes. They look like they might have been worn once, maybe. And we got those for $5. We ended up buying a Ohio State Archie Griffin kids jersey. We paid $1.50 for it. We got a Cleveland Indians, fitted hat, new era. We paid $1.50 for that. We've got a UFC shirt, Anderson Silva, Dan Henderson. We paid $1.50 for that. Got a VHS DVD combo that we paid. It was $7.99. It was 50% off. We got it for $3.50. And I believe that was it. All right, we just stopped at the Goodwill in Athens, Ohio. We got a Marilyn Monroe Misfits collab t-shirt. I've never seen one of these, but in the middle and inside it says Misfits and Marilyn Monroe. So it is licensed by both. I've never seen that collab before. And picked up a Slipknot long tee. And we ended up paying four dollars and 48 cents for that and we got our senior discount so that's all we ended up getting there all right our next store was a little can't remember what it's called it's a little place in uh athens ohio that's where we normally get the 10 cent uh cassette tapes and vhs's we didn't find any cassette tapes today but we did get this betty boop hat it's new 
I'm gonna be getting 10 VHS's. Basically, I just had to get 10 so I can pay it, you know, spend a dollar. And four of them were sealed blank tape, so I just wanted the blank tapes. And the hat was half price, I think, and these toys are half price. And I'm getting some kind of horse and knight and some army men, and it was 50 cents. So we'll make some kid happy at the store. We stopped at the Goodwill, and let's see what we got. Got a Marines t-shirt. Thought that had a cool graphic on it, so I had to have it. Got a Jake Owen concert shirt. All these t-shirts were $2 a piece, and we got 30% off. Got a Luke Bryan. We have the Beatles. Johnny Cash. Phil Collins. Concert shirt. We really hit the jackpot on the rock concert shirts. All right, we got a Harley Davidson t-shirt. I think that was a 2X. No, it's a 5X. I'll see if I can wear that. We got the Oak Ridge Boys concert shirt. In this moment, I'm guessing that's a band. I couldn't tell I was a DJ for 15 years. <laughs> Eric Church, Kenny Chesney, Buckeye Country Superfest, had Jason Aldean, Luke Bryan, Florida Georgia Line. All those guys were at it. Cute little dog shirt. I like those. The Mountain has really nice t-shirts. I always buy their shirts. Got a... Like a gag bikini shirt. And that was everything we got at the Goodwill. We really hit the score on the uh, concert t-shirts. We sell a lot of concert t-shirts and stuff like that. So I was glad to get those. All right. Stay tuned. Hey, we just got out of the Salvation Army. And uh, we picked this up. It's a uh, NFL. It's got the NFL logo and, and the tag. Cowboys cowboy hat. Uh, we looked online for comps. And uh, the only one we found on there was going for about I don't know, $80 to $100 with shipping. So that was a good find. We ended up paying $4.99 for that. This was a uh, Made in USA single stitch. And it says, when an old woman, I shall wear purple. I looked that up and it was uh, some kind of book. So, I thought, what the heck, I'll buy it. It was single stitch. Got a snap-on t-shirt. Wonder Woman t-shirt. Got a Dragon Ball Z t-shirt. Here's a WVU Major Attractions t-shirt, or sweatshirt. Uh, this, uh, this is actually from the 80s when uh, Major Harris played for West Virginia. And uh, Major Harris is one of my best friends. He's been in all my movies that I've made. So uh, it's, always kinda, it's always special when I find something of his. I always think it's kind of cool. He's got this cool shirt. In case you guys uh, don't know who Major Harris is, go check out his highlights on YouTube. He was one of the greatest college football players ever. Got a little Rugrats t-shirt. And a Journey Don't Stop Believing t-shirt. We also got a little Erector set. We paid uh, $3.99 for that, and we can sell that for like $10 in the store, maybe. Uh, how to play rock guitar. We sell musical instruments in our store. 
And we got this Tommy Hill figure. Fake. Because I don't think Tommy ever did a collab with uh, Gloria. I don't know. I have a sneaky suspicion it's fake. It's 100% fake, but it's cool. Some people collect the uh, the old bootleg. I mean, it's a vintage bootleg. I mean, it's made in USA. Somebody might want it. Oh, yeah. Taylor Swift guitar picks. We paid a dollar for that. And that's what we got at the Salvation Army. All right, I know all you guys have like a certain little place you like to go. You know, you kind of call it your little honey hole. Uh, personally, my honey hole is the Salvation Army near my house. Uh, I always get something good there almost every time I go. And I go about four times a week. So, uh, went there this morning. And here's what I got. For nine, nine I actually had a 25% uh, off coupon. So, I only paid about $40 for this whole haul. Here, I'm going to show you. We got this uh, Skylanders case. What's cool is it comes with, you know, the little thing, and plus a ton of Skylanders. I mean, there must be, I don't know, 20 or 30 Skylanders in there probably. And we got that all for $10. I don't know if you guys have noticed there, once in a while, instead of four, I say fur. I don't know why. Uh, I guess I live too close to West Virginia. <laughs> but uh, I'm going to try to stop saying that. Because I, I go back and listen to my tapes, I'm like, that sounds kind of stupid. All right, four. We got this 2X monster truck shirt. And we paid uh, $2, plus, like I said, we had the coupon. Get this Harley Davidson sweatshirt. Double sided. It's a 2X. Actually, it's made in the USA, so it's probably vintage. We got a Dale Jr. like crew shirt that the crew wear, crew members wear. Got this cool skeleton shirt. It was two dollars. I think the crew shirt was two ninety nine. This is a single stitch, probably from the eighties. Some kind of zoo. I just got it because it was an all-over double-sided print of zebra. I thought it was pretty cool. He had some kind of North Carolina zoo. Like I said, it's a single stitch shirt. It's really thin. Um, Converse. Normally they price their Converse really high. Normally they charge $10 for like any pair of Converse. For some reason, they only had $4.99 on these, and plus, I got 25% off, so I was very happy to find those. I said, Converse is probably one of my best-selling shoes. They might even sell better than Nike's. Hard Rock Cafe, Myrtle Beach shirt, taking care of business shirt. I wasn't going to buy this until I looked, and it had an Elvis Presley tag, so and it looks older. might be worth something. I didn't look it up, but... I said it was only two dollars, minus thirty percent, so uh, it was a dollar sixty. This is a made in USA. Looks like it's a single single stitch shirt. So I got a blank. The blank single stitches do very well on eBay. I got two of them. I just sold three blanks yesterday for fifty bucks. Here's a uh, Michael Jackson shirt. It's got like a North Face shirt. This is a uh, Pluma, made in USA. Single stitch blank shirt. 
there again. Like I said, I'll probably get like 20 bucks for it. Here's a Dale Jr. shirt. I have a few Dale Jr. fans that come to my store. And I'll probably sell them there. And we got two seasons of Supernatural. Steel sealed. $2.99 a piece. I'll probably get at least $15 a piece out of these at the store. So that was a good deal. All right, man. It's I still don't have my air conditioner fixed. And it's really hot out here. I apologize if I'm sweating to death. All right. We got this Imagine X. I can't remember what he's, he's called. But we got it for $5. And usually I sell those for about 20 or $25. All right, last thing here, uh, they had a $5 bag sale. I wonder, this is, our, my, this is my bag. It's just one of those little Walmart bags. I paid $5 for everything I'm about to show you. I can't believe we got all this stuff in this bag. Let's go to it. This is a double stitch made in USA. American United We Stand, Virginia Tech. I'm guessing this might have been when the, the first Virginia Tech accident or thing happened years ago. But uh, it's a nice shirt made in USA. I think it would do all right. United, or Buckeyes, 2002 National Championship sweatshirt. Here's a nice ooh, Columbia jacket with a hood. And this is a nice jacket. Nice Columbia jack ski jacket. It's got a nice colorway. It's got a hood. Kind of looks like a, it's like a 90s. It's also a Columbia. So I got two nice Columbia jackets. Last but not least, remember this whole bag was five bucks. Last but not least, we got a Lakers. Kind of like letter, Letterman jacket type thing. Varsity jacket, I think they called it. Got the big L. Got the... Uh, you know, Lakers patch on the sleeve. I believe it's made by Unk. But uh, it's large. I mean, it's it needs some, some wiping down and stuff. But it's not in bad condition. But uh, I can't believe I got all that for $5. I'll make some money on that. I'll probably put, you know, $20 or $25 a piece on those jackets at the store. And it's getting to be summertime. So, or, yeah, it's, it's getting to be wintertime. Uh, like I said, everybody has their special little honey hole. That is, is like my honey hole place that every, every time I go, it, it never fails. I do really well. I mean, you know, sometimes better than others, but I always seem to find something. I went probably a 30 row streak where I found, I bought something 30 days in a row, but, uh, put in the comments. Do you guys have a honey holes or a certain place that you go? You know, you don't have to say the exact place, but you know, put in the comments, you know, where your honey hole is, where your go-to place oh. is. Uh, hey, thanks for listening to me ramble. Have a good one, man. Hey, just for you guys that this is your first time here, once again, I've been a reseller since 1997, uh, full-time reseller. I haven't had a job since 1997. I've been working for myself. Started selling eBay in 97. And uh, I used to run a thousand auctions a week back then. So uh, I've been doing it for a long time. Uh, make sure you check out all the other videos. I'm not just a media guy, I do all kinds of stuff. Please like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. Catch you later, guys. Man, I'm gonna be in the movie, man. I want the, the zombie to chase me, man. I'm gonna run the other way like in a Penn State game. You know what I mean? I'm gonna break the tackles, man. Get downfield, you know what I mean? And get home.